he had a month. The deadline ends tonight at midnight, and four hours before that deadline, he announced that he would seek immunity. And if he didn't, he would be charged tomorrow morning in court, the defendant, Benjamin Netanyahu. So by doing this, he did, has put that off for some time. Uh, on the other hand, it wasn't expected because when he was asked whether he would do this, and this was just before the last election, he said, no, no, certainly not. Uh, and previously, before he was charged, whenever anything like this came up, the mantra, you know, he used to repeat over and over again is, there won't be anything because there isn't anything. So the feeling in the public is that you ask for immunity, you don't ask for immunity if you're innocent. If you're innocent, you go to court and prove that. You ask for immunity if you're guilty. And that's what the leader of the opposition said tonight. And in, interestingly, polls show that a majority of Israelis, something like 57%, don't think he should be granted immunity. So that's why he went on TV tonight to tell the public why he was taking this controversial step. How much, uh, Iris, is this likely to uh, delay criminal proceedings against him? You know, it, it absolutely could delay it for months at least. <clears throat> he now is in this very interesting position. Uh, it's not automatic. He goes to the parliament and requests immunity. And a parliamentary committee convenes to hear that. And it's decided pretty much along party lines. But at the moment, because it's only a caretaker parliament and there isn't a proper government, that committee isn't sitting. So now there's a huge debate over whether that committee will sit. Now, if the opposition wins and the committee does sit and Netanyahu doesn't have his, the numbers, he could be out before the next election. If his party wins and the committee doesn't sit, he could buy himself months and months of time. And I think that's partly the aim of this, as well as the reasons that he gives, which is that it's not a fair trial, he can't have a fair trial, he's being persecuted, and that that's why he's seeking this, this immunity deal.